the, the most um, essential thing was that uh, Germany uh, was successful in creating a dependable investment atmosphere for companies. Um, and this was done by a very uh, long-lasting and stable feed-in tariff uh, law, which gave investors a security to invest into um, renewable energy systems. And um, not only for investors this was important, but also for companies to invest in innovation, in this, uh, uh, production facilities and into new products. I would say um, renewable energies do not really affect the daily life, um, which is the good news. The good news are that um, the um, security of energy supply did not change at all. So there are no, there are no power outages because of renewable energies. Um, another a change was that you can see installation of wind turbines or photovoltaic systems um, and that the affiliation of people um, to renewable energies increased because they saw uh, renewable energies installed and the acceptance of the non-polluting and uh, silent technologies, especially photovoltaic, uh, increased as well. Well, uh, I, as I told at the beginning, um, it was essential to have a, a, a feed-in tariff law. And so policy makers um, are essential for, for this to create a, 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 a well-working feed-in tariff law. Um, but policy makers do not do anything without the support of uh, the society, so the public acceptance um, on the, uh, of renewable energies as well as the public wish to move to a, a sustainable energy system is, is also very important um, to um, give policy makers a strong push to move into renewables. I believe oil and gas um, technologies, especially oil um, or energy sources which are not mainly used for uh, generating electricity. So I do not see a direct uh, a large competition between oil and photovoltaics. I see in principle uh, a competition between fossil fuels and uh, oil and gas and solar thermal. Um, but in my view, um, the, the low oil and gas price uh, will be a short phenomenon. Um, what we see at the moment is that investments in um, uh, oil and gas exploring technologies uh, are cut, um, which will result in, in the medium term uh, future into uh, very high oil and gas prices again, so um, renewables will be then even more competitive.